I don't know. What's this lady got to say? This lady... Oh, God. Okay, so this this is a channel called Destiny Image. This is from the... This came out today. November 23rd. Wow. Okay. Yeah, this came out today. This is called... This is our 1775 from Janet Porter. Where are we in the battle for our constitutional republic? Attorney Sidney Powell said it best. It is the 1775 of, of our generation. And, and This is Sidney Powell, the lawyer who has been fired from the Trump legal team as of like yesterday for espousing QAnon conspiracy theories and other conspiracies. And beyond. Much like then, American heroes today are being censored, mocked, threatened, and now prohibited from observing and verifying our votes. Oh These my god, you weren't prevented from either of those things. You were not prevented from either watching the votes get counted. Again, in court, Trump's lawyers said, yes, we did have observers in the room. Stop believing the lies that they are saying outside of the courtroom where they aren't being held under penalty of perjury. Because once they are and they're in front of the judge, they're like, no, there's no fraud. We don't have any allegations of fraud. Because they know they'll get in trouble for doing that. Because it's illegal to lie under oath, as it turns out. These heroes are undaunted. You see, in 1775, American patriots weren't treated like heroes There's either. About Only about 25% supported the American Revolution. Only 7 to 8% actually participated. Failed art kid with 50 bits. Sidney Powell's voice cracked worse than mine when my tee shots finally started kicking in. <laughs> but God is famous for working through remnants. Oh my God. Look, if, you, if you're religious, that's fine. But God was not working through the Founding Fathers to create America. Nations rise and nations fall all the time. History is full of it, and it's because of human action, not because of divine intervention. Our founders in 1775 so capitalism. believed in liberty. Tucker White 94, a citation is needed for those American Revolution support numbers. I know that they were surprisingly low. I mean, the country was pretty split. As it turns out, surprise, surprise, pretty much no matter what the political issue is, you know, a population of any given size is going to have differing political opinions within it. ...that they were willing to fight the most powerful nation on earth. If they had the internet then, Patrick Henry's declaration may have looked like this. Fact checked that the... <laughs> Great Britain is the projected winner of the Revolutionary War. You know how we project winners of wars that are ongoing? What? Okay, if the news was reporting that, like, a certain person won the war and the war was over... It's probably because that's the correct thing that they're reporting on, right? We aren't in the middle of the Revolutionary War right now. We're weeks after an election. An election Joe Biden won and Donald Trump lost. Frustrating. Winner of the Revolutionary War is Great Britain. But despite what the fact checkers may have proclaimed, we won the battle for liberty and we will win it again. I never say anything I can't prove. And President Trump won by not just hundreds of thousands of votes, but by millions of votes. The lines are drawn, and the battle is for liberty or tyranny again. Our history is being written right now. On which side will your name appear? Remember, the same side that put Republicans in pens to prevent verification of... <laughs> put them in pens! They're outside! They're on the outside! What are you talking about? Our votes also wants to lock us in our homes. Those people who oh my god. You're, it's a disease, you idiots. You idiots! Voted. Amen. You made this happen. Who won by millions again? Let's see. Oh look. Joe Biden won. By six million votes. Weird how that works, huh? Yes, the side that celebrated election fraud in the streets wants to prohibit- Uh, no. 
they were celebrating Donald Trump losing, as it turns out. Weird how you can make sentences seem really, really misleading when you word them that way. Thanksgiving and cancel your Christmas. We have a hundred more of these. I can't show them to you because those people don't want to be harassed. They don't want to be <laughs> we have a hundred people who made these claims, but I can't show them to you. Trust me, though. Uh. We have their lives torn apart by the goons on the other side. The only lawyer that left a case left because he was threatened. His family was threatened. His children were threatened. And so was the other lawyer. Yeah, that's true. We have a, a little difficulty getting lawyers because our lawyers get threatened with being killed. A lawyer shouldn't have to with- Or, hear me out on this one. Or, the lawyers don't want their law licenses taken away for committing malpractice or lying in front of a court by saying that there's fraud when there's absolutely no evidence to that effect. Maybe consider that. Withdraw from the case because he's representing the President of the United States. Those threatening our lawyers and doxing our witnesses are the same ones attacking our elderly in the streets. You see, this isn't just a battle for our president, our votes, and our Constitution. It's an American revolution against a Marxist mob rule. <laughs> Dr. Gamble with 20 bits to these... People even think before they speak, how dumb do you look when you are saying the fact checkers are wrong? That like saying the doctors are wrong about COVID. Oh, wait. Yeah, they're stupid. Always remember, they are... It's almost like uh, hoisting up anti-intellectualism as a virtue will cause a severe brain drain for your side. And then everyone who ends up agreeing with you are only stupid people. And then you're not good at getting anything done. It's weird how that works. Coming after me That's right, Captain, because Captain, I am Captain. fighting for you. That's what's happening. The president's been fighting for us. Now it's time to stand with him. It was in 1776 when our Bam, heroic banana. founders for pledged their lives, their fortunes, and their sacred honor. We must do no less. But this battle runs... Their lives, their fortunes, and their sacred honor. How'd some of them make those fortunes? Just curious. Thomas Jefferson specifically. It's much deeper than the swamp. We are wrestling against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in heavenly places. The good news is that in addition to the truth, the evidence, the Constitution, and the U.S. Supreme Court, we have something else they don't have. A God that is more powerful than all the principalities and powers. And he's this white guy! Yay! <laughs> you think the, the, the disciples are for like, damn, Jesus. We are out in the sun, walking by the Sea of Galilee every day. How do you keep so porcelain white? nothing funny about the tools of capitalism. American politics is so exhausting. I just, I... <sighs> Cotton Candy 903 with 20 bits. If there's anything this election has taught me, it's that the right is almost too stupid to live. And is that Cat Stevens? <laughs> While they mock God, his principles, and claim dominion, God sits in the heavens and laughs. But to prevail against the strongholds we're facing, it's going to take more than a passing prayer. It's time to bring out the big guns. It's time- It's so weird to me. Like... I, I don't even believe that there's a deity, right? But like, if there were, and they were like... And this is going to be obviously because everyone thinks that their morals are the morally correct ones. But to me, it seems like if there was an all-powerful, omnipotent, like, omnipotent, omniscient creator of the universe, wouldn't that creator, like, look at Republicans and just be like, you dumb, dumb people. Like, you have science and you're pretending a virus doesn't exist. What are you doing? And you're... Yeah. You're trying to subvert, like, d democratic elections. Not cool. I don't know. I, I just, I don't know. I don't know.
time to fast in some way until this war is won. This is our 1775. So let's do what our There's heroic fathers did. Inspired by the writings of John... What are these, like, the the morphs that are happening as the transitions are so terrible? Tucker White 94 with 20 bits. Oh shit, God's on their side? Okay, pack it up, guys. All the George Soros, blessed be his name, money in the world isn't going to defeat a Sky Fairy. True. Unlock, they made an appeal to heaven. This is the flag George Washington commissioned to fly over our ships in the American Revolution. It was the banner we were born under. Now it's time to make an appeal to heaven There's again. Nothing funny about the tools of Father, we Stare. praise Thanks you and subscribing. thank you for how richly you have blessed America and ask for your grace and mercy on our nation once again. We appeal to you, the one who said, let there be light. And thank you that nothing is secret that will not be revealed nor anything hidden that will not be known and come to light. We pray for you to give courage to the whistleblowers, to expose what they have seen now, so that every shred of evidence needed can be documented and presented to the courts and to the American people. We also pray you protect, encourage, and infuse inner strength in President Trump and all those fighting on the front lines for the truth and for justice. We ask you to There's commission your warring angel armies to engage in this battle, to uphold and restore the integrity of our elections, and for America to remain one nation with liberty and justice for all. We pray this in the name above all names, the name of Jesus Christ. There's nothing funny about the tools of capitalism. We will not be intimidated. Tucker White 94, if God was on your side, why did he lose in the first place? Yeah, it's stupid. David. American patriots are fed up with the corruption from the local level to the highest level of our government. And we are going to take this country back. We are not going to be intimidated. We are not- She's like the final boss Karen. If there was like a Karen video game. Not going to back down. We are going to clean this mess up now. President Trump won by a landslide. We are going to prove it and we are going to reclaim the United States of America for the people who vote for freedom. And by the way, One American News is the new Fox News. Parler is the new Twitter. Rumble is the new YouTube. Freedom Book is the new Facebook. And your local freedom business book. is the new Amazon. <laughs> and one more thing, we're going to win. And I didn't know Freedom Book was a thing. Whoever created Freedom Fries should sue them. Mm-hmm. <laughs>